Well, you can see the flowers that have been placed near that tree here behind me by the driver's family. State police say he collided head on with another car before crashing into this driveway. And tonight, neighbors tell me this isn't the first serious wreck that's happened right here in this spot. Long stretch of, of screeching brakes. It was 1130 last night when Jeff Morrison heard the crash not far from his house. The other car going fast ended up in the front yard of that house over there. State police say the 41 year old driver of this white Mercedes was speeding west on Linfels Parkway when he crossed into oncoming traffic, colliding with another car. There was a, a car that was hit from the front with a uh, two passengers in, this, in the middle of the road. Investigators say the white car then slammed into two SUVs parked in a neighbor's driveway. Police say the driver, a man from Randolph, died at the scene. It's horrifying for, for parents, for neighbors to, to see this continuously happening. Carrie Bailey also heard the crash. She says it's the second serious wreck they've seen in just a few months. It's a straightaway and you can be going at a very high speed rate of speed and so by the time you realize there's a curb it's too late to hit the brakes and you're going to go right into that house. She says neighbors are working together hoping someone will do something about this dangerous stretch of road. At night is I think the the higher speed that's happening and that's because of this curve that you just can't see and it's the design of the road that needs to be remedied. Now, state police say the two people in the other car that were hit were taken to the hospital and are doing okay.